What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and in today's video we are going to be going ahead and creating my house. So this is really cool and I uh, wanted to say thanks to Spartan Kyle, this is Xbox name, for showing me this house. So this is one of the cooler houses I've seen in the game. So this is going to be home base for me until something better comes out in Dragon or something comes out in any of the future updates but I really like this we're gonna do I might not furnish it all today because this is a lot but uh, I think I'm gonna try to put my bed and stuff up here because I think I think this is a good spot to do that so we're at least gonna do that did I just get myself stuck oh my gosh dude okay well time to escape that um we're gonna do at least the bed part up stop up top in a little bit of maybe the second floor Probably leave the first floor a little bit bare right now, because uh, I have a feeling it's gonna, you know, it's gonna cost some, cost some money to furnish this whole thing. But should be some good fun. I'll show you exactly where it is on the map in Camasovia. Sorry for the PlayStation people who don't have access to this, but the houses that I showed in Alta Nova, those are the ones that I would suggest if you want a two-story house. I really like those houses. Obviously, they you have to go outside to go up and down, but, but it's still pretty good house. So. Here is the house, right? Oh, no, it's not. Where is... It's Grana 4. So I have to find it on the map again. So we're in Grana. So Grana is in Camasylvia and it's down here. Obviously, you guys know I haven't been doing too much Camasylvia because I don't think I'm properly prepared. So I kind of ran around and just found this area so I could do this. And is this Grana 4? Where is Grana 4? Uh, da, 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 da. That's why I started in Grana 4, so I didn't have to do it like this. Where the heck is Grana 4? Is this Grana 4? Okay, Grana 4 is behind this thing. So let's go right here. Is this Grana 4? This should be Grana 4. Okay. After a little bit of mishap there, not knowing where my house is, there we go. So this is Grana 4. And so now I can show you better on the map. So if you go to Grana and you go in, it is right down here in the bottom right corner if you don't turn your map at all. Uh, Grana 4 is here. Grana 3 is this two-story right here. And then to the right of it is Grana 5. Uh, so we're in Grana 4, like I said. So let's get started on this. So we're going to go all the way up to the top here. And let's get started placing items. So I think this is a really awkward looking... Like, the house looks really awkward from this view. Let's see, can I zoom in a little bit here? Okay, so zoom in. Yeah, I think that, that works. Okay, so we need to get a bed first. So let's find our bed. So the winter wood bed I do like. There's actually four floors to this. What do they consider a floor? Hold on. What do they consider a floor? So this is one floor... Is this considered a floor here? I guess this is considered a floor, and then that down there is considered... Okay, so that's the four floors, I would guess. Okay, so let's get let's get this going. So, I do like the winter bed. I need to zoom in again so that we can see this when I place the items. Okay. So, winter bed. I do like the look of the winter bed. Uh, looks really nice. Uh, another option is the coral bed. I don't like this one as much. Not as good of a bed. Um, let's see. There's also the spring flower bed, which the spring flower and the winter are very close for me. I think I still prefer the winter a little bit more. I kind of like the design of it. Uh, what else do we have here? Where is the next bed? We have the pirate's bed, wherever it is. Oops, that's a drawers. Vel Pirate's Bed. This is like a luxurious bed if you look at it. It's kind of like crazy luxurious. Part of me wants to get this bed, but... Is this bed free? Hold on. This bed is free. It changes everything. No, it's 500 Why does it say non-applicable for, for the price? Okay, good. I didn't buy it. Why does it say non-applicable for the price? I thought all the other ones say their price. Obviously, that says non-applicable because I already own it. Oh, I guess they all say non-applicable. Huh. So I just have to guess how much this stuff is? I don't really... That's not... I don't like that. Then I have to just, just 
get, I have to play stuff in order to find out how much it is. The Keplin Marble Decorated Bed. I do like this, if it'll let me put it. It's like a really cheap looking bed. Um, but it, it, it gets the job done. It's not like super bulky. There's not like a bunch of stuff around it. That's kind of why I like it. Uh, I think we have, is there one more bed to take a look at? The Karudo style bed. I don't like, this one's like super plain. And, but it looks better than the marbled one, but still super, the leather one, that one just looks odd. The Python bed, this one's kind of cool, but still not great. So I'm going to go ahead and get the winter bed. I really like the winter bed. So we're going to go ahead and get that and place that right here. My favorite bed, it's pretty much centered. So we're going to put that there. Okay, so now we need to move on to the next item for this upstairs area, and that is the drawers and whatnot. So I'm actually going to go with the coral drawers here. Uh, if you want to see, let's see, where is the... Oh yeah, that's why, because the coral, the coral has drawers, the winner doesn't have any drawers whatsoever, so... I'm going to rotate this and put it over here in the corner... It'll let me put it in the corner. Put it there. Now, I want the... Where is it? The coral dresser. Da, 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 da. Let's see. There we go. Actually, I want the winter wardrobe. So we're going to put the winter wardrobe now in the other corner. A little bit less room in this corner. So I think I'm going to turn it... I'm actually going to turn it and put it over here. We're going to put it over here next to... I think this will work. I can always move it. But I think that works right there. I think. And then I want the winter bedside table over here. Right next to my bed. Oops. Right there. Oops. Didn't double tap A. Put it right there. And then I want to put the winter wood table. Actually, is there a winter bedside? Oh, no, I want the coral bedside table. Sorry. Coral table. Is there an actual one labeled bedside table, or is it just the coral table? I think it's just the coral. Yeah, it's just the coral table. Okay, and I want to put this one on this side. There we go. Put that there. And now, I think maybe change the floor. I don't want uh, I don't want to change it in the whole house. I can't have different ones for different parts of the house. I kind of just like the wood floor that they have in here. The wood floor, I like the pattern on the wood floor. I think I'm just going to leave the wooden floor. Drapeless curtain. This could actually look really nice depending on how this works. I don't think it works out. It doesn't work how I think it was going to work. I was going to put it like right by the stairs as like a walkway in, but don't think that's how that works. So next, um, I think I want to put in the bookshelf here. So this is the winter bookshelf. And I think a good spot for this is over here. Um, I don't want to block off all of the view to look out. So we're going to check out now. We're going to purchase all and place them here and see how it looks. And then we're going to keep going. So let's go ahead and put, purchase those and put them down in exit place mode. So yeah, we got a little bit of a gap here. How functional is this stuff? I like to get the buff from the installment. Only one installment buff is allowed at a time. Okay, so I can get different buffs from that. Can we put different stuff in these drawers? No. I wish you could actually, these were more functional, I guess. Can I sit on my bed? Oh, look at that. I can actually go to sleep in the bed. I wish my character actually put her head on the pillow. What's the point of the pillows? But I, th I think I want to leave this side open. As I think I want to put like a chair over here and something like that to have like a view to look out. But I really like how the bed this bedroom is coming along so far. Looking pretty nice. So let's go ahead. Uh, are my pets in here? Are my like random other pets in here? Yeah, they're there. They're down there. Okay. Let's see, so now we need a chair. We have our wardrobe, we have, we could put a table up here. That would be interesting. The one thing that I'm not happy about this house is that you see that little like patio area out there. You can't put anything there, which kind of disappoints me. 
because I feel like that would have been really cool. Uh, the winter wooden sofa. So this sofa is real weird to me. I think it goes like this, but it's 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 an odd sofa. I don't really like the winter sofa. I do like the coral sofa. Now this sofa is nice. I think I might just angle it like this, looking out the window. I'll have to see. I'm going to put it down, and then we're going to see how it looks when I put it down there. I can't actually put it right there. we got to move it a little bit. Eh. Let's see. Can I put it? Ooh, I can put it right there, I think. Mm. Let's see here. I'm going to cancel that and replace it. I think I, I can get this right. I, I pretty much know what I want it to be here. So let's put it. If I can get, can I get it right there? Oh, I can get it right there. Okay. So purchase that. Quit the place mode. So in the terms of like real life, I think that's actually kind of a decent view to sit and look out. I might tilt it the other way, but that would make it hard with the bed there. But that's nice you can see out towards the fountain you can kind of see out the window i think if it was like a first person perspective like this you could kind of tilt your head and look i think we might want to change the placement just a little bit so let me zoom back in it looks like this is gonna it's really expensive to do a house this might be something that we do like once a month i don't know maybe not even once a month that this is whoo this is a hefty this is a hefty boy to do this okay i want to do a like a manual rotation can i oh i might have this clutched out so turn it just a little bit more tilt it right into there right there that might be the spot that might be the spot if i can get yeah you can sit all the way over on the edge perfect that uh that's where I want it, because I would like a sofa to look out, um, to look out the the window there up in my bedroom. So that's nice. That's exactly what I wanted. So now we need some bookshelves up here. Bookshelves. Do I want? The, I don't. I think I want the coral bookshelves. Where's the coral bookshelf? Could do the coral war, wardrobe. This also has a really cool look. I have to try to sneak it past this. There we go. Why is it like freezing in location here? Why is it getting, there we go. Why is it getting like frozen? Like not letting me move it around. This is really weird. It kind of knocks off that whole entire corner of the room, which I don't love. There's not really anywhere else to put it. If I put it here, it just it kind of blocks off the whole area. Hmm. Guess we could just call it here for the upstairs part. We don't really need bookshelves up here. We got our wardrobe. We got our bed. We got a couch to look out at the beautiful view outside. Yeah, let's do a little bit of furnishing down on this floor. Maybe. I don't even know if we need to furnish this floor at all. Uh, yeah, I'd like to put some stuff by this door here. So let's do a let's let's see how these flower tables will look. So zoom in. Put those right there. Oh yeah, that looks good. I like that. Put the flower tables right next to the entrance way. And could actually do like another little table in the corner here. I feel like that would look good. I feel like that's kind of a waste of our... But if I could get this area done, the top two floors done, we can do other floors in later episodes. So I think that looks that looks fairly nice. It looks real symmetrical, but, but I like it. I think it looks pretty nice. Um, do we want a little something here? Um... I could put a chair in. I could put a spring chair in. What do I have here? A python chair? We could put a pair of python. I think I can get a python chair. 
Ooh, yes. Fits into the corner right next to that. Okay, let me see if I can find a Python. Because I, I should have a free Python chair. Or I, I use my free Python chair. I should be able to buy a Python chair. Yeah, there we go. I think it's a little offline. So, like, right there. We pretty much spent all of our money. So, I'll probably reload and do another one of these episodes in a real soon but after that episode i'll probably wait to do another episode that looks nice i like that i wish there were lights because this is like really dark it's really dark in here but i guess this is how it would be in this day and age i mean but i wish i could have like some magical torches or something like that to light this up but that looks really nice i like that i like this area right here the shadows right there are really bad let me put my jukebox down up here, the free jukebox that I have. Because we might as well put that down. I think I put it by. Let me put it behind. Ooh, perfect. Perfect. Right. Come on, slide it a little bit more. Perfect. Right there. Beautiful. So you can start some music, and then you can sit down and look out the window, watch, look at the view, watch the sunset. I like it. I like it. I might end up putting a chair here eventually so you could sit next to the jukebox, but I don't really know if I need to do that. So we have 400 pearls left. We can do a little bit more before we call it an episode. So what what other stuff do they have here other than that? Other than, other than the furniture. We have that. That's about it. Other than the furniture, there's not much, not much left, but there is... I mean, I could go with this ceiling decor, chandeliers, that's cool. Ooh, how much is a chandelier? Hold on, how much is a chandelier? Um, I don't know. I want to put a chandelier up here. I don't know if it'll work because it's a it's a peak roof, but we're gonna we're gonna find out. Can we put a chandelier up here? Oh yeah, you can put alchemy tools and stuff in here. I need to I need to buy some of those cuz you can get those for free off the marketplace. So I'll probably buy some of those for our next episode before I do that episode. Um Where is Cos Ooh. Yeah, I don't think I get. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I need to make sure this is centered. I guess I can move it if I don't like where it is. What other chandeliers do we have? No. Oh yeah, it's gotta be the it's gotta be the cosmic. This thing is cool. Cosmic Dawn. I think right there is where I want it. Two fifty eight. I can afford. Or no, it's four hundred. I can afford it. It was exactly what I could afford. Oh, look at that light. That's sweet. The chandeliers give off light. Now, that's not where I want it after after seeing the placement. But, yes, the chandeliers give off light. Perfect. Awesome. So, wall decorations. There's no lights for the walls. But the fact that we have chandeliers for lights is awesome. I'm super excited about that. See, this is how you get me to spend money is to, like, have really... Really kind of cool designed stuff. Now, do I think this is like the best design like housing and stuff? No, but that is sick. That cosmic chandelier is awesome. And I'm so happy I can hang it from the roof here uh, up in my bedroom. So like you can get into bed. And look at that. Look at that chandelier. That is awesome. I'm really happy with the progress that we made on the house today. Um, like I said, we'll be updating it at various points in time in the future. Maybe I'll try to do one video on the house a month. Uh, hopefully I can get it fully furnished and ready to go before Dragon comes out. Or not before Dragon comes out. Well, before I find a new house, which I maybe be in Dragon, but it would have to be a really nice house. But I'll show you guys what really disappoints me is this down here. I really don't like this down here. You can't customize anything out here. This would have been sick. You could have had, like, couches and everything out here. And it's, like, it would have been awesome. That's my one disappointment is that you can't edit out here because they put the stupid door here. They should have just put, like, a, 
I don't know, a curtain, a curtain doesn't work, but they should have just made this door not a door for the residency, and then let you do it up here, let you build up here, because that would have made this house like a hundred times better. But unfortunately they didn't, so we, we get what we get. We get what we get. So my pets have somewhere to live now. My pets that are not in use get, have somewhere to live. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty darn happy with this house. Not gonna lie. I'm pretty darn happy with it right now. Obviously, got a long way to go and a lot of money, unfortunately. But, uh, I'll try to maybe grab some stuff off the auction house instead of spending real money on it. But I bought that, though, I bought, like, a thousand, or, like, 2,000 points for the specific purpose of doing this episode. Uh, because I want a cool house. If I'm going to play this game for forever, I really want a cool house. And so I'm willing to invest a little bit of money to have fun. Um, so, yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop a big old like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. Let me know if you guys have any suggestions for my house going forward in the future. Uh, always willing to listen and hear all of that. And I will see you guys uh, in the next video. Not exactly sure when the, what day this is going out. But uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace. Cause when it's all over, the love that you give